onion glock, onion G, onion bread, pull up on the lock. Now he dead. Boop, what's goody? It's your boy Harry's Red back with this NBA 2K22 Courage in. With something a little different, I want to start a new series on the channel, my NBA Legend Build series. On the channel, man, the purpose of this series is I want to hop in the build system. So I want to make NBA Legends and making builds on this game is really, really fun in my opinion. Sometimes it's actually fun to play the game, get into the build system, see what we can make on the game. But for the, without further ado, we want to get into the first player, the first edition on this series. And what other player than Larry Bird, man? Larry Bird is a legend. He's one, I believe he's the only player in NBA history to ever win the MVP three times in a row. Three times in a row, he won the MVP. Um, I think he won the first three point contest where he came in and said, Hey, so who's going for second place? This man is a god, bro, in my opinion, bro. On the basketball court, he was he was, he moved slow like Luca and um Luca and Jokic is how they play, but boy, was he deadly on the court. Man, so I wanna get into the uh, building system and see what we can do. Now the first build, this build right here, is gonna get you the shades of Larry Bird at the top. Then I'm gonna show you another build where it's more park friendly. So let's get into it, let's go. First I'm gonna go Larry Bird as usual. Position small forward because in the game he is a small forward first. Um, I think he was right hand and jersey number 33. All right, the pie chart we wanna go right here is the mostly green and yellow pie chart. And now I went into the system and I seen his um his physicals, he had a 65 speed, a 65 strength, a 65 excel, and a 54 vertical. So, we want to go with not the most uncommon pie chart, in my opinion, is the speed and strength pie chart. I don't see a lot of people using this pie chart, but we want to go to speed and the strength pie chart. All right, so on the close shot, we want to max out close shot, max out our um, driving layup. We're gonna go all the way up to 36 on the driving dunk, and we want to max out post up and leave us right with three finishing badges. We're gonna max out mid range, three point, skip, free throw, and we want to go 83 on the post fade. No, we want to actually go 61 on the free throw and 83 on the post fade to give us right at 18 shoot badges. We want to max out pass accuracy, ball control, and go all the way. 73 on the post control so we'll have 26 playmaking he was he was a very very good playmaker if you go watch videos he's clowning people on the court i mean absolutely clowning people want to max out perimeter lateral steal max out our defense and put the rest on our offensive rebound so we're going to get three finishing 18 shoot 26 playmaking and six defensive badges now this is not bad. If you want to use this at the park, this is really not a bad um, build at all. Because for all my post scorers out there, you can really use you can really use it as a post scoring build, low key. All right. So for the body shape, we want to go solid because he was he wasn't the most athletic person in the world. He didn't look athletic at all. But we want to go solid. We want to go to six eight. And we want to go all the way to 214 on the weight so we can keep the uh, 60 strip and have a, like a little bit of speed. And we want to go to, I believe, I believe, yeah. So we can keep the 70 ball control. We want to max out the wingspan, go down one on the wingspan, go to 89.0 inches on the wingspan. So, this build at 99 will have an 80 plus 3 ball. We have a 70 um, 4 ball handle. And you have pretty decent um, defense to, have, to be able to do what you want to do at 99. The speed with um, Gym Rat. There's three ways to get Gym Rat. Either go to the Gatorade facility, do the Gatorade workout, do what I um, just dropped, become a starter, sim to the playoffs, play the whole playoffs. And that's how you get your as well. And hit level 40 in any one season, then you'll get your all built. So
so that'd be a plus eight to all your physicals you have an 82 speed and 80 excel we have a if i'm not mistaken 60 vert and a 50 not a 50 a 66 strength not bad not bad at all and continue these are the takeovers that we're going to have to our well to this later bird build the first edition playmaking post scoring sharp and shot i want to go sharp shooting take without further ado we have the pass first wing shades of larry bird at the top now we're going to get into the second version of this build the more part friendly version the version that i would make if y'all boys wanted me to grind this build out let's get it let go of this build instead of going um small four we want to go power four right hand number 33 we want to go to the same pie chart, the green and yellow pie chart. And this time around, we're going to go to pure speed. All right. Want to max out driving layup, driving dunk. That'll be all with the finishing. Want to max out mid range, three point free throw. And we're going to go to 69 on the post fade to give us right at 20. Want to go to 72 on the pass accuracy. 65 on the ball handle and 78 on the post control to give us right at 20. Want to go to 66 on the interior and max out perimeter, lateral, you get block, offensive rebound, and put the rest on the defensive rebound. So we have a, a 50 badge, one, one finishing, 20 shooting, 20 playmaking, and 9 defensive. Larry Bird build in my opinion. This is not bad at all. This would be the, like the more park friendly build. More park friendly Larry Bird build in my opinion. We wanna go back to solid. We wanna go down to 6'8. And we wanna go 208 on the weight. And we wanna keep the wingspan the exact same right here. So at 99, we'll be able to get um we won't be able to get park ducks if you want. To go right here you can but i want to keep that three ball and on his um actual player in the game he doesn't have a high driving dunk anyway so i want to um keep the wingspan just just right there but you will keep the same name at the end so if you want to get those park dunks you can do that you can do that but i want to keep the three ball so we have a 65 driving dunk we have an 80 plus three at 99 we have a 74 ball handle Want to make sure we have that 70 ball handle because he could dribble the ball now. He was a great ball handler in my opinion. He was a great ball handler, so we want to keep that 70 ball control so we can unlock some more dribbles, unlock those that um, the um cheesy LeBron um size signature size up. So we want to get that as well. Um, on the defensive end, we're going to be very very good on defense. Um, a 60 offensive rebound is not bad at all. A lot of people don't pin up their office rebound but i suggest you put it up but we're going to have a 70 plus perimeter and lateral on a 6-8 build which is not bad not bad at all and on the face we're going to add plus eight to everything so we have an 85 speed and 83 excel a 69 vert and a 55 strength i think so at 6-8 not bad not bad at all and these are the takeovers of course you have the usual sharp play shot and pull scoring, but me, I feel like Larry Bird was more of a sharp shooter, so of course we're gonna sharp shooter take over, and we get the stretch facilitator build. Not gonna go over the badges due to time constraints. Hopefully, y'all boys enjoyed this video, man. I wanna, I wanna start up a new build. Um, a new NBA Legends build series on the channel, man. I'm gonna drop a couple videos just to see how y'all boys um feeling them, just to see how y'all boys liking the videos. But hopefully y'all boys enjoyed this video, man. I'll be showing y'all boys two versions of Larry Bird, man. Like, comment, subscribe if y'all boys are new. We out.